Well, 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 what do we have here? Cracked heads, every valve rattles, oil leaks, engine ticks, cheap, hardly efficient vehicle, races only electric trains, something like that. <laughs> Well, not only do all those things happen, but so too do taillights break, and as I discovered today at my friendly local Napa Auto Parts store, that particular lens assembly is $70, and they're actually supposedly cutting me quite a deal on that because I have uh, done quite a bit of computer work for them in the past. But the key keeper, he's the man with the plan. He's got an idea here. Ingenuity is my middle name. <laughs> Get in my drill, fool! He's gone ahead and drilled a hole right there into the remaining portion of the plastic, as you can see. And what we're going to do, although I normally detest zip ties, they do have their purposes. We're going to zip tie that through the holes. Definitely a redneck repair. But when you don't have the $70 and you don't feel like driving to a junkyard, well, by golly, you got to do something. Especially since you have to be able to haul all your treasures around legally. I'll be somewhat amazed if this actually works. Are you doubting me? No, I'm You're not doubting, doubting you. I just know my kind of luck. <laughs> Amazingly though, for the, despite the fact that the, uh, the screw moldings are broken for that, as are the little speed nut things that mounted there once upon a time, that thing never fell off or blew away at highway speeds. No, the only time that it seemed to go anywhere at all is when I was driving around town or if I hung a particularly sharp turn somewhere. You should never have to drive, you should never have to adjust your driving habits to avoid shifting your cargo. If you do, then you haven't restrained it nearly enough. I rode the window like bus to school today. What kind of a bus did you ride to school? Window licking. The window licking bus. Yeah, it's a, another name for a retard rocket. That's not a politically correct word. You're not allowed to say that today. Oh, the fuck. Whoa, we're going to have to edit the video there. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> Fudge. Alright, here we go. This is the moment of truth. Cut me, man. Cut me. Oh, I'm going to cut you bad. <laughs> That's just the kind of thing to say to your brother, isn't it? Alright, what do you do with those? Those are the extra screws that we had left now, over. Now we see if it actually will shut. We hit the gas with it in reverse so they spill out on the driveway and take off the tires. Yeah, I'd, I'd say it shuts. We'll have to road test it, though. And that just looked like great fun. Probably should have used some zip ties on the air compressor to hold it in place too. By the way, no air compressors were harmed during the making of this video. And just in case you thought I'd forgotten, no, I certainly haven't. Typical General Motors piece of crap! <laughs>